Hey guys, Jared Waldman with Krav Maga United. So today I'm going to take you through the entire Yellow Belt curriculum. All right, guys, wrist releases. Uh, we have a soft technique version for when we're dealing with somebody maybe at a bar situation, a little bit drunk. We're not trying to escalate the situation, we're trying to de-escalate. That's where we'd employ a soft technique or a hard technique where someone grabs us and we realize our life's in danger and we gotta act accordingly. So let's talk about the soft technique. Um, wrist releases, grabbing the wrist. One hand on one hand, two hands on one hand, lots of different variations, real simple principles. So if you were to grab me, same side, so we call this same side grab. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm expanding my wrist by opening up my hands. Think about his wrist is like the lock, my hand is the key. I'm gonna rotate the thumb side to where his thumb and pointer finger meet or even if they wrap around. I rotate to the opening, so I'm basically opening the lock. I take my elbow towards his elbow, everything else stays in place, and then I create space and now I'm in a de-escalating position. My hands are facing forward like a stop position but I'm in my stance in case he decides to escalate. So once again, same side, rotate, open that lock. Thumb is on the same side as thumb and pointer finger, elbow to elbow, I create leverage, I create space. That's wrist control, same side. Opposite side, same principle. His hand is the lock, my hand is the key. I open my hand to expand it, that expands my wrist a little bit. I'm gonna rotate that thumb in the lock, now I'm gonna take that elbow towards his elbow, and now I'm out. Again, so rotate the key, elbow to elbow, create space. One more time, rotate the key, elbow towards his elbow, and I'm out. Okay. Two hands high, all I'm gonna do is the same idea. This time I'm rotating the pinkies, because that's the closest to his opening. I'm gonna tuck my chin as I step back, making a circular motion. Again, two hands high. I tuck my chin in case of a headbutt. I step back as I chop down and rotate out, again, to create space, which gives me time to see and react. Two hands low, opposite motion. Again, hands open up. I'm bringing the thumbs up the middle, but I'm gonna curl my fingers just in case I poke myself in the eyes. I'm gonna bring my hands towards my chest, and I step back and I circle to the outside. Again, I curl my fingers so that I don't bring the fingers up towards my eyes. I intentionally trying to bring the hands to my chest, but just in case, added measure. I rotate in and then circle out. Two hands on one. If there's no weight pressing down, I make a fist with that hand, I reach in, grab that fist, I bring the fist just above the two wrists, and I rotate elbow to elbow, just like the basic same side, and I'm out. Two hands, I make a fist so that I can catch on, lift that fist up just above the wrist, rotate towards the elbow, create space, okay? Two hands when the weight is down. For whatever reason, maybe he's forcing me down or I have too much weight on top of me. Obviously, I'm not gonna go strength against strength. So there's my hooks. I pluck, just like I do against chokes, using the palm heel of my hand. I pluck the support hand. Now this becomes the same thing as before. Elbow to elbow, hand opens, rotate the key in the lock, elbow to elbow, and I create distance.